TikTok sued by 13 U.S. states for harming young people's mental health. 13 U.S. states and Washington, D.C. are suing TikTok over claims it is harming children's mental health and not doing enough to protect them. The lawsuits allege the video sharing app is designed to be addictive and keep teenagers glued to the screen. TikTok said the claims were inaccurate and misleading and pointed to features such as default screen time and privacy settings for under 16s. The legal action is another blow for the app, owned by Chinese firm ByteDance, which already faces a potential US ban over fears it could give data to the Beijing government, something it insists will not happen. Young people are struggling with their mental health because of addictive social media platforms like TikTok, said New York Attorney General Letitia James. She also alleged young people had died and been injured copying stunts they had watched. Her counterpart in Washington, D.C., Brian Schwalb, called it an intentionally addictive product. His lawsuit accuses TikTok of causing profound psychological and physiological harms including depression, anxiety, and body dysmorphia. Other claims in the mass legal action include that a virtual strip club with no age restrictions is effectively able to operate via TikTok's live streaming and virtual currency functions. TikTok spokesperson Alex Horek said he was dismayed the states had not chosen to work with the service on their concerns. We're proud of and remain deeply committed to the work we've done to protect teens and we will continue to update and improve our product. We've endeavored to work with the attorneys general for over two years, and it is incredibly disappointing they have taken this step rather than work with us on constructive solutions to industry-wide challenges, he said. TikTok provides safety features including default screen time limits and privacy defaults for users under the age of 16, the company said. TikTok also doesn't allow under-13s to use its main service and restricts some content for under-18s. Those suing under the new action are California, Illinois, Kentucky, Louisiana, Massachusetts, Mississippi, New Jersey, New York, North Carolina, Oregon, South Carolina, Vermont, Washington State, as well as Washington, D.C. Other U.S. states have previously launched similar child protection cases against TikTok. In August, the U.S. Justice Department also sued the app at a federal level for allegedly failing to protect children's privacy. However, the main threat remains a new U.S. law which threatens to ban TikTok in the new year unless ByteDance sells it. The company has appealed against the ruling and judges are expected to issue a decision which could ultimately end up in the Supreme Court.